20 or 30 steps that you have to get to to get the end result. This is one, two. Okay? Okay? Step. If I'm here, he strikes at me. One, two. I'm in top of him. He's not going to throw any strikes at me. I've got the advantage. If I want to take his weapon, I can. If all I want to do is to get him off me, Is that right in the eyes you want? I went right to the forehead, just right to the forehead. What you do is you pull him down, okay? Boom! I'm pulling him down. Now I raise him up. When I raise him up, his balance is backwards. Okay. I'm acting like a chin strap on a uh, football helmet. Okay? And if I slide off, you go right to the forehead and push down. Okay, so one, block, two, all at once. From right here, I want the weapon. I take the weapon. Quick, precise, doesn't take a whole lot of extra steps. If you miss it, it don't matter. You've already got the weapon free so it's not to be used against you. That's what you want in self-defense anyway. No matter your opponent from doing any damage. Okay, so that's the next one. Pull, hit, and strike. Then decide what you want to do. Kick him in the crotch, fine. Grab the staff and pull cube, fine. Grab the staff, beat him, fine. If you want to go straight through, fine. You have tons of options once the door is open. Go for that. 